New York City's meatpacking district was once an Indian trail that led to the Hudson River. It was a Dutch tobacco plantation. It was the home of Fort Gansevoort and eventually became a huge farmer's market. And we're not even up to 1900 yet. These days the area is really known for its fashion and nightlife, but back in the early 1900s there were about 250 slaughterhouses in this area. And today we're meeting up with Pat Lafreda whose family business got started right here in the heart of it all. All right, Pat, tell me all about the family business for people who don't know. Our family business got started down here in the 20s. All meat coming from out west would have to hit someplace in New York City, and this is where it hit. Here I am, in the city. Just right around the corner here on Washington Street, my grandfather and his older brother would get beef deliveries from the High Line train. They then moved to Little West 12th Street, and then to Bleecker Street, and then Leroy Street. So how many restaurants do you supply now? In New York City, it's a thousand restaurants. Wow, and we're gonna check out some of them today. We're gonna get to try some of yes. your custom blends. We're gonna start at the standard here on the west side. All right, Pat, we have to talk about your new book, so appropriately named, Meat. Yes. Everything you need to know. Every question that someone in our industry, like a chef, has asked me, I answered in this book. All of our family stories in there, and then 75 recipes. We're yes. at the Standard Grill. Great American food here in the meatpacking district, a bit of a hot spot. And you are the person they get their meat from. Yes. So next time you bite into a burger or steak here, this is who you should thank. All right, Pat, I think we're off to a good start, but next we're headed to the West Village. Let's go. Pat, we are on the corner of Pat LaFrieda Lane. Why? It's named after my grandfather and our family and the business. That comes from decades and generations of being a part of the West Village and supporting it. Wow, that's a really nice tribute. All right, so we're a few blocks away now from Pat LaFrieda Lane at Commerce, a West Village favorite. What did you bring out for us here? I love tripe. The fact that it's at Commerce all year round as opposed to really just during the cold winter months makes it a favorite of mine. This is his French dip sandwich and the Commerce chicken. And when you say his, we're talking about Harold Moore. Yes. Pat, thank you for teaching me so much about your family and the meat business today. Thank you so much. I appreciate it. Cheers. Cheers.